Sports fans, and some more sports. Back in your business with some hockey action today. Got a good number of hockey fans that I know subscribe to the channel here. Um, unfortunately, my hockey videos are always my least uh, <laughs> least viewed. So uh, we need the hockey fans to view um, each video, each hockey video, ten times. In order to level out the uh, the view count, I do love hockey cards though. I think I'm gonna go with some grape gum. say rainbow but it kind of is and this is a, a parallel called black rainbow kind of cool I suspect maybe we'll get two of those per pack but this one is Anze Kopitar and a rookie nice Lucas Dot Dustel probably sleeve that one up Matthew Barzell <laughs> and a Brad Marchand, captain of the uh, Bruins. So there's one pack. We'll see. So I I wonder if we'll get one rookie per pack, and then maybe one or two of those black rainbow. Per pack, kind of what I'm imagining. Maybe if we get a different. 
different color parallel will replace one of the black rainbows that we got in this in the first pack. So let's see, yeah. Um, oh, it's kind of a fun one. Um, so we got a blue, oh, just a one blue uh, parallel, no black rainbows. All right, Robert Thomas is our first card. I'm going to save that till the end here. Isaac Radcliffe. Oh, so there's one rookie. Take that out. Jordan Cairo. Sebastian Ajo. Base. And the Robert Thomas we've already seen. So uh, we've got, I don't know if this is just the color of a insert, but pretty cool. You don't see a lot of Wayne Gretzky's coming out of modern hockey, but sometimes you do. Yeah, so I, I think this is just a you know, insert that happens to have a blue background, but it's pretty cool looking. You know, it's got a refractory finish like every other card in this set, so I'll definitely take that. Pretty cool. Well, I don't know. Both of those packs have been pretty different uh, since that's just an insert. You know, we kind of got zero parallels in that second pack, so maybe the two rainbows were an anomaly. It's like we got maybe a couple of, yeah, very interesting. Um, I'm trying to see what that one kind of uh, the box was talking about. Inserts white diamond base set parallel. I think maybe we got a white diamond. I don't know. We'll see. Ah, very nice. Kale McCarr. Good star player right there. Let's leave him. Quinn Hughes. Also a good young player. Alright, so I don't. I, maybe this is a white diamond. It's a rookie, Mark McLaughlin. See what it says. Yeah, white diamond. So that's cool. I, you know, it just said um, retail exclusive white diamond base set. That says to me it's probably not a rare, a very rare parallel. But uh, we've only got one so far, so it's okay. This is pretty cool. Um, I don't know what the name of this parallel is, but it's got these multicolored little dots on there. And it is a rookie, Lucas Reichel. So I like that. And last card is Artemi Panarin. So we're going to see what this is called. Glitter Bomb. Very cool. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, it doesn't really say. Um, so I see there's some odds on there. I'm going to take it off screen so I can read it. Um, so black. Black rainbow parallels are one in six packs. So we got two in one pack, and there's only five packs per box, so that's definitely being the odds. They got red rainbow, they got orange slice, they got gold glitter bomb, number two, 199. White diamond are one in four packs. Glitter bomb is one in eight packs. Okay, so not a super, you know, kind of rare parallel, but a not a one per pack kind of parallel. I like this product, you guys. There's a, just a ton of interesting um, parallels. Fair number of rookies. I don't know. I like Allure. Am I wrong? Am I wrong to like Allure? I mean, I realize that I'll, you know, as with everything, I'll probably get like one tenth of the value that I paid for this box back in, you know, singles value, but I'm having a good time, and really that's what matters. Okay, another rookie, Victor Loden. Jared McCann. Wrong Kraken right there. Matt Grigelchik. Josh Norris. I am looking insert. Okay, nice. One of these color flows mentioned on the box. This is Samuel Fagemo. Fagemo. Red orange color flow. I don't know. I'll sleeve it. Why not? Okay. Last.
last pack. Can we get a Shane Wright? Have I gotten a Shane Wright card yet? I don't think I have. I haven't really opened much 2020. Alright, isn't that the second Anze Kopitar? I feel like we got one in the first pack. Um, oh, we got the Kopitar, Kareel. Oh man, I keep getting the wrong. Kraken, Yanni, Gorday. This is uh, another one of those diamond. What are they called? White diamond. God, I wish that was a Shane Wright. And another Kareel. This uh, is an iced out insert. Pretty cool. I don't have a lot of Kareel, and you know. I'm up in Minnesota Wild Territory, so fun to get his stuff. So I got to tell you guys, I really like this stuff. I mean, it's super fun. I kind of want to see, like, what um, this almost makes me want to, like, get a hobby box of this stuff. So I kind of want to see um, what uh, this stuff is selling, so it's selling for. So hang on one sec. All right, so uh, here we go with um, the uh, selection of Allure Hockey 2022 at, at Dave and Adams. I also looked at Below, and they basically didn't have anything. Well, actually, they had just had, like, the hobby stuff, and they didn't even have pricing listed. You had to um, contact them for pricing, and I presume that's because, like, Upper Deck kind of restricts, you know, pricing on their products, so you have to be careful about having a pricing that's lower than their... MSRP or whatever. David Adams, however, does seem to have their pricing live. Um, and it's kind of crazy. The um, hobby boxes are eighty nine ninety five. You get one autograph or memorabilia card per box, plus nine of those color flows. This seems like a bargain to me. Um, so, Matty Paneers, Marco Rossi, Shane Wright, Owen Power. Yeah, this is tempting to get one of these guys. Um, get some of these. Nice. Connor McDavid rookie. Or not rookie, auto, I mean. Austin Matthews autos. Okay, so that's the color flows that kind of like, you know, work as a little sort of set to get all the colors kind of kind of cool I stout that was the one Kareel we got so um yeah I was mainly looking to see like what they charge for the uh, blaster boxes if they had them but it looks like they they don't even have them so they just have the um, the hobby boxes but boy that's that's tempting at 90 bucks she was, well, I don't know, a few hockey fans want to lobby me to <laughs> pick some of those up. Um, I'm willing to listen. It's all pretty cool stuff. Let's sleeve these up. Take a little kind of spin. I feel like I need to have a Shane right from this up. I don't even know how Shane Wright's doing this year. Is he like just sort of a having a sophomore slump like a lot of guys do, or is he uh, doing pretty well, or somewhere in between, or is he injured? I don't know. No idea how anybody's doing in hockey. Um, but yeah, we'll throw these in the the old hockey box, hockey card box. take off, especially one that we got like a parallel of, and maybe that card will be worth a few bucks down the line. That's what we got for today, folks. I like that one. Confetti, I think that was a call, something like that. Um, Alright folks, thanks so much for watching, appreciate you. Please give a like and subscribe, and uh, Remember to log on to your parents' account and watch this video. 
See you later.